All right, what's up, guys? Welcome back. I'm Pyrotechnic. I don't know what this is. For thousands of years, humans have existed next to a world of unimaginable horror. Very rarely encountered, the line between these worlds is not impermeable. Too close to the edge. There is a chance that we pass to the other side. Oh shit. Ooh. Welcome to Conclusion that has like old school Resident Evil fucking. Ooh. Ooh, and it's intended to be super low resolutions. Oh. Ooh. Oh. It says intended. I guess I gotta follow the rules. They want it to look like a PlayStation 1 game. I remember when I downloaded this one. They're like, we want the resolution to stay super small. We want it to look like, you know, it's supposed to be, you know, PlayStation 1. All right, and it looks like our old Resident Evil main menu, so I'm really excited about that. Three years ago, Ooh. my wife, Carolyn, disappeared without a trace. I followed every lead, but they all led to dead ends. After searching for years and coming up empty-handed, I gave up and thought I had moved on. Unfortunately, that couldn't have been further from the truth. Caroline, could you really be here? Living in a place like this? Sounds like almost script for script for Silent Hill, but okay. After three years of searching for your missing wife, Caroline, you received an anonymous tip. Caller said your wife was alive and well, living in a town New England called Hell. You mean Silent Hill? You thought it was a joke. But after some research, you found the town does exist. Now as you're about to go live, you wonder if this really be true? Could Carolyn really be here in Silent Hill? Animations and everything's very well done now. Silent, I mean, kind of clues. <laughs> Thank you. All right, I'm actually legit excited. It does look great. Let's see what we got. That I'm about ready to eat. Okay, this looks good. Okay. Don't hit escape, man. No, not to hit escape. Oh, first person. Oh, this is very Silent Hill Resident Evil. Okay. Ah, there. Something wrong. There's something wrong with you. I don't know what's wrong with you. There's an elderly woman with broken things sleeping in a subway car. Try to get her attention, but she doesn't really. Maybe she's supposed to leave her alone. Indeed, of course. Indeed, of course. Yeah? Was that a cane or a crowbar? A plain red crowbar. Alright. Door won't move. Uh. Was there an inventory? Oh, shit. No way to wedge the crow case, it'll do it automatically. God, see. This is almost a real pain on the ass to play in this resolution. You know, like, I get it, but it's kind of a pain in the ass. I'm gonna stick with it, but it's kind of a pain in the ass. Okay, uh, just making sure there's nothing down here. Any Easter more eggs?
Holy shit. What? Caleb. What? What? Michael. What? Okay. This is the final stop. Please exit the train. Thank you. What kind of fucking subway am I on? Demon subway. Uh, I can't just go through these. Oh, okay, downtown. Amongst the discarded pieces of trash, you find a key. Hell, I picked up the employee key. Hell yeah. Alright. Ooh, really like old fashioned Resident Evil cutscenes. I really do like it. Even has like that second pause. For sake of reference, we're not going to call him Pyramid Head. <laughs> we're going to call him... Conehead. <laughs> yes. We'll never know. Alright, so let's just go back this way. Does that mean the employee key? I'm going to unlock the stupid amounts of chains and shackles or whatever the fuck they got around the stuff? Yes! I can read that text wonderfully. I have come to unlock this stupid bullshit. Hello. Yes. Okay. Arrgh. It is very clear what I am supposed to uptown. Updog. What is updog? Oh, okay, I got the key. I don't know. I, I love it being very clear. Once again, it's probably my fault. Not the developer murmurs. Okay. And before I adjust the resolution so I can see. Because wandering around in the dark is fucking fun. But it's probably the point of this game. Alright. There's nothing down here. There's no place else I can go. Got it. Now we know. Okay. There's no unlocking this with the key that we found. The only option that I appear to have is to go... Downtown, where the fights are broken, you go downtown, where you buy a token, you go, go to Skid Row. No, but for no. Oh, oh. What? Oh, I thought I was just going through the fence. I'm like, come on, man. Alright, so he left. Oh, okay, the train moved, so does that mean I can actually get on the track now? Okay, okay, my brain's working, my brain's working, my brain's working. And no. I can jump now. Oh! Level design! Figure it out! Can't bitch too much. I mean, where's my fucking video game, right? I feel you on that. Oh, sweet lord. What the fuck? Alright. 
that seemed super cool. I was super into it. I can't figure out what the fuck to do. I can't go back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, hoping to find, you know, something. I, I can't, I can't do it. I can't, I can't do it. I will break shit and lose my fucking temper. Uh, but yeah, thank you guys for watching on Power Technic. Uh, it looked really good uh, for what I could see of it. Uh, but I understand that they want, they wanted you to play it in a low resolution. You know what? Fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck it. I'm, I'm, you know what? Fuck it. You talk me into it, guys. You talk me into it. We're going to go back. We're going to up the resolution just to see if we can fucking see what the fuck is going on. Fuck, 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 fuck. Fuck you, Studio Snow Spot. I'm joking. I'm sure this is going to be awesome. An aspiring indie. All right, T. Allen. I'm going to up your resolution because I can't see your fucking For games. thousands of years. Humans have existed next to a world of... Oh, I had a skip button for those who have already played it. <sighs> oh, Alan. Oh, game developers. Oh, God. Oh. Oh. <sighs> On clues. Alright. Oh my god, it's like my eyes just fucking. It makes me feel like I need to grab my glasses. Alright, this is not better. It's really not. Damn it. How let you guys talk me into trying this again? Okay. So, we cannot use the key here. There's no other buttons. No inventory, no nothing. Uh, ooh, right there, inventory. Employee key. No use. Okay, cool. Alright, uh... Just let me pass this... Oh my god, I was like, I just jumped over the turnstiles the whole time. I, guys, it really appears like the only places I can go is the key. Chained and locked. I have a key, but it's obviously not the right key. Alright. Up dog. We're going to up dog. Alright. Uh, what's that? Is that a book floating? Are you serious? That's a book floating right there, isn't it? I don't know. I'm not trying to pretend I know everything, but it looks like a fucking book just floating. Oh boy. I just want to progress. Please let me progress. I wish to progress in your story. It looks cool. I wish to be able to read your blur text. <sighs> All right. Super cool looking. Uh, not very functional, not very playable. Uh, didn't know where to go. Uh, so, developer, if you ever, ever, ever watch this, I am truly intrigued by your game. I could not figure out how to progress. Maybe it's because I'm stupid, or maybe it's because you need to work on your level design. One of the two. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. I'm going to cut it here. That had a lot of potential, but definitely let me down. Anyway, stop streaming. Stop recording.